Wemlinger's in interrogation. Take a look at this Emmy report first. Victim's throat was torn out by what appears to be some kind of an animal. I don't think Wemlinger's an animal. Probably not. Our killers must have had some kind of a garden tool. You know, one of those claw things? Maybe. Let's go talk to Wemlinger. Do you know something I don't? Because I don't see how this guy could have done that. Just a gut feeling. I'm all right, it's your gut. Hold on. Just got the prince back. Got a hit on your suspect. Wemlinger? AKA Simon Kincaid. Wanted for embezzling $975,000 from the Bankers Trust in Sacramento <laughs> three years ago. Doesn't make him a murderer. But it certainly puts him at the party. I'm starting to feel it in my gut, too. You and Mr. Childs were working pretty late last night. You always work that late. Depends on the work. Stay till it's done. What were you working on last night? Getting out the quarterly reports. We have 217 clients. And why was Mr. Childs there so late? I don't know. He was the boss. It's under a lot of pressure. You have access to all the accounts? Yes, but I'm not the only one. Were any money missing from the company? No. You sure about that? As far as I know. Isn't it your job to know? My job covers a wide range of responsibilities. You ever heard of Bankers Trust in Sacramento? Maybe you've heard of Simon Kincaid. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. You were stealing money from CNE Investments just like you were stealing from Bankers Trust. I was not. I told you there were two other men inside. I saw them. Security cameras didn't. Mr. Childs found out what you were doing, and you killed them. No. No. Ah! You're Simon Kincaid, and we have fingerprints to prove it. And I know you're a mess. You don't know what you're talking about. And I want to talk to a lawyer. Give him his call. Did he vogue? Yeah. I think it's a key out of view. Have we dealt with one? No, but I've read about him. Capable of ripping the throat out. Oh, yeah. So we know he did it, we just can't prove it. What are you doing here, Nick? I thought you were taking some time off. I asked him to observe while we were questioning Wumlinger. You think he's going to see something I don't? It's got nothing to do with that. No, 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 no. I want to hear. Did I miss something? You got something for me to book this guy on? I'll take it easy. All I'm saying is, you're going to bring another guy in. Tell me. Right now, we got bigger problems. Two U.S. Marshals just got here. What do they want? Our suspect. Hey, I'm Detective Griffin. This is Detective Poe. Dan Reeves, Ray Durant. We got a hit on Simon Kincaid this morning. Guess you know him as Paul Wemlinger. He's so wanted in Sacramento. We're taking him back to California. That's a warrant. He's a suspect in a murder case. Sorry, guys. He's ours now. Where is he? Right this way. We can't let them take him. They have a warrant. Yeah, and no idea what they're dealing with. I gotta warn him. How are you gonna do that? Nick. Hey, you guys got a minute? I'm Detective Burkhart. What? You have to be careful with this guy. I think we can handle him. No, you don't understand. He is not what he seems. We know all about him. No, you don't. This guy, he's dangerous. He's an ink man. What's he gonna do? For just to death? <laughs> you don't know what this guy is capable of. You know, detective, just because we got babysitting duty doesn't give you the right to bust our balls. I'm not busting your balls. You a badass? <laughs> Let's go, man. something from inside? Yeah, grab me a juice. All right. Can I use the bathroom? It's such a long ride. I got him. Let's go. Don't forget, he's a dangerous guy. So I've been told. All right. 
Do what you gotta do. Can you please take these off? No. And the door stays open. up about to get on the 405. Nobody said anything about a death threat. All right, we'll wait for him. <laughs> 